What's your name? Hiya, oh, yeah. I'm Janice. This is Max. Ah, oh, well, now that we've got the introductions out. Shh! Trying to have a conversation here. Psst. I was going to go home until I saw you. I'm not interested, all right. So there we are. Not interested? I ain't even made you an offer yet. I know what you're offering, and you've got a pretty high opinion of yourself if you think this is going to get me to drop my knickers. Yes. OK, that's it. You're leaving. You think I've got a high opinion of myself? Well, it's not as bad as a low opinion you've got of yourself. And if I wanted someone easy, I'd be talking to you, mate. Hey, you cheeky get. You don't even know me. You ever do? Right. To the cooler. Why me? Why? Because you're a slapper. Uh, that's just one of the reasons. Oi! Take that back. Just leave it, all right? No. Who do you think he is talking to you like that? The teacher. Look, I don't need you sticking up for me, all right? Especially when you created this problem in the first place. Just back off, will you? Later, babes. Oh, and you? You feel they know on me. <laughs> <laughs> minutes left. Yeah, a lot can happen in five minutes. What are you talking about? Just leave it. Is it something to do with your brother? I said, just leave it. Don't think you know me because you don't. And you, you surely are not. Damn. I told you to keep your hands off me. And I did. Yeah, right. You saw what happened to me, so I didn't ask him to come in here, did I? I will. I have quiet. The time he's ever spoke to me. Yeah, well, I don't believe you. I will. Again. Quiet! Ah, uh, uh, Mr. Mr. Lawson, I was just... Yes, OK. Listen carefully. I want you all to collect your things together. Go with Mr. Budgeon to the school playground. You will do this in absolute silence. Do I make myself clear? Uh, look, I know they were a bit noisy, but teaching a class outside is punishment. It's nothing to do with that. What has it got? Just do it, Grandpa. I believe Mr. Lawson said silence. Oi! What? What do you think? Where are you going? Somewhere that's not here. Why are you coming? No! Earl, I thought we weren't doing this again. Doing what? This! You acting like a psycho. Don't call me that. Why not? It's the truth, isn't it? I mean, why else do we keep having to move? You do something mental and it comes back on the rest of us. Don't call me mental, Well, then stop acting mental. Earl, you've been here five minutes and already you're acting like a nutter. I won't tell you again. Don't say stuff like that about me, OK? OK? Yeah, OK. Nice one. I'll see you later, bro.
can ask you the same thing. I don't know. You told us to get our stuff, go outside and be dead quiet. Right. Come on, let's see what's happening. Everybody have your bags right. open, ready right. to be checked, please. Did you hear that? Bags open, please, and ready. It's not an excuse for talking. Eden Charles Bosch. All of our hearts. Yes. Great, isn't it? Yeah, great. Come on, we'll get some target practice. It's not just a fire drill. What are they making everyone to the box out for? Me up. No one grasses me up. We've done everything we could have done. We've completely evacuated this school. We've checked for stragglers. We're in the process of searching everyone's bags. Well, I take it that nothing has turned up? No, not yet. Well, we're just taking a full register to make sure no one's missing. We've taken control of the situation, Ralph. Well. As long as everyone's safe. Have you seen Dante? No. He's probably messing around with that stupid van. Idiot. I could kill him sometimes. Quiet. Ow. 